What's up guys? Welcome back to Call of the Wild, the Angler, where we're doing the challenge missions. Right now we're on our last Diamond's Peak challenge mission, which is photo challenge number three, where we gotta catch a diamond ranked yellow perch at the photo location. Now this location is pretty iconic. We know exactly where this is at, right? This is at the uh, steam lakes or the uh, the really pretty colored ones. That's where this is at. Which is all the way over here. It's this lake right here. So we're just going to fast travel right on over there. Right, so that photo challenge, looking at it, it looked like we were over here by these boats. I would think something, oh, yeah. <laughs> I need to activate the mission. That would help. <laughs> that would help if we activated the mission, huh? There we go. Oh, look at that. It's telling us to go way the fuck up there. Well, that's just dumb. So I do remember this. This was retarded. What they make you go through just to do this. So there's actually a path right up here. We're just going to walk up this path. There's that boat automatically slowing down for us, which is fine. I don't care. Right, now we're going to sprint over. Or do our best to sprint. It doesn't like sprinting uphill. Understandably, I don't like sprinting uphill either. I hated that crap in the military. Oh, we gotta get through all these rocks too. Joy! This has gotta be the dumbest fucking trigger point in this game. Excuse my language. Like why? Why, why are we going all the way up here? Oh, thank god they fixed this one too. Oh, thank god they fixed this one too. Before, you, has to, you used to have to go up to that rock you see dead center of the screen, all the way up there. You used to have to get up on top of that rock. Thankfully, they fixed that. Oh, that makes me so happy. Thank you, EW, for fixing that nonsense. Still kind of stupid that we got to walk all the way over there, but at least you fixed it. Give credit where it's due, right? Give credit where it's due. You know what the hell am I doing? Let's fast travel back over here. Right, so you don't need the boat for this. You just fish right off the dock here. And uh, we'll take a look at what we're working with here. So we're going after diamonds. So I put a number six hook on there. I've also got number fives with us because they have tweaked some of the fish mechanics in this game. But we're going to start with the number six with leeches, and we're going to see where this gets us with these perch. If we have to bump it up to a five, we will. I don't think we will, though. I think we'll be all right. I like to fish right off this left-hand side here. We'll go to uh, two feet, and uh, the hell, we'll just short cast it. We'll see what we get. I hope that Discord message that just popped up wasn't EW saying, oh hey, we, we put in another hotfix. <laughs> that would screw me all up. See, I'm not seeing any perch. What's going on now? Come on. Show me the diamonds. We might have to long cast this one, huh? Or we might have to wait till nighttime because perch are nocturnal. Yeah, I'm not seeing nothing. Alright. Tell you what. We got anything jumping over around here? Out over that way. Could go over that way if we wanted to. We can also just cast out. 
Oh, there's some jumps. Doesn't mean they're out there, but we'll give it a go. So we're at the hot springs, that's why we got this blurriness in this area. It's to kind of simulate that uh that effect, um, that mirage type effect. That's what it's doing. Oh look at this, we got we got we got a guy right up in here. I see you. You're probably not a diamond though, but I see you. Can we entice you over? Oop, there's one right there too. Will he be enticed over? No. So that tells me these guys are probably golds, and that this this hook might be a little too big for them. I really don't want to have to get into the boat. I'd prefer not to get into the boat. These diamond missions generally take a bit longer than the other ones. So this one definitely, probably, most likely will be a two-parter. We'll find out. Those fish that were over here, they ain't having none of that. Alright. So when I do these long casts, I usually count to about 35. And once I get to 35, I'll reel in about 20 feet, count to 35, reel in 20 feet, count to 35. And that just gives the fish time to actually hit it. And if they're not hitting it by 35 seconds, they're probably not going to. So you can go ahead and reel in, try to get to a different location to where the fish will be like, oh, hey, I need to eat this. You do the same thing with jigging, too. All right, you know what? This hook might actually be too big, so they might have changed up the mechanics a little bit. We might have to go to a smaller hook, which kind of surprises me, to be honest with you. So we'll go to our number seven. We know we're going to catch goals with this. Hopefully we'll get a diamond. But we're going to give it a try, see what happens. I got the gold that's that's to be expected so I think we just have to find where the diamonds hiding at right I should actually do this the way I normally do it so I'll normally short cast well, I'm about to fall off this damp here I'll normally short cast all the way around and then I'll switch to long casting and come back and usually by then I get what I need usually I'm not saying it's guaranteed, but usually. And I don't know if I, I was collecting information on that. I think we did, right? I think we collected this information on the, uh, the last mission. Let's see here. Perch, number seven, leech, gold. Yep, we got that. I'm wondering if I should switch this up to bloodworm. I'm going to do it because we don't got no mastery in the bloodworms. Let's try it out. Alright, well it says Bloodworm is a preferred lure, or preferred bait. 
and I just presented this right in front of a fish and he completely ignored it. So that's not going to work. Um, let's try... See on number 7 all we got is the leeches. We have to go to number 6 for the red worm. I mean, that might be what we have to do. I guess we can try it. Alright, screw this red worm shit. Man, we're going back to the leeches. Um, we've been catching golds with the leeches. So we should be able to theoretically catch a diamond with them as well. Uh, the question is, do I want to stick with the number 6? They were not biting on the number six. Oh, decisions, right? We're going to go back to the leeches, though, that's for sure. And I think we're going to go ahead and uh, just call the boat over here. We're going to go out on the boat. Because why not? I know I said you don't need to, but at this point, what difference does it make? We're not getting the fish we want, so. Let's see here. We're on the starboard side. Fair enough. We're just going to cast out here on the starboard side then. So they all just going to disappear and pretend like they ain't here. Now that I'm on the boat. I see how it is. You know, we're going to drop this leader down all the way. This, this is a pretty deep lake. Looks like it anyways. I see some jumping action over there. Well, she hit fire. There we go. <laughs> there we go. So for our diamond purse, we used a number seven leech. So we got gold and diamond with those. All right, and that concludes the Diamond's Peak Challenge missions with that catch right there. I mean, that's, that's cool, right? I think that's cool. Even though our, our finger is um, going right through the fish in multiple spots, um, that's cringe. But, you know, hey, it's a perch. We're happy. We're good to go. So before I sign off today, um, again, I am doing or I am going to do a beginner's guide. And I would like your feedback on what you would like to see in the beginner's guide. What information do you want to know as a beginner? Uh, any tips and tricks that you would like to know? All that good stuff. Throw it in the comment section and uh, I'll, I'll try to be sure to include it with the beginner's guide. So with that guys, um, actually, I know I just said it. We're going to go through it again because... We do at the end of all these videos. We come up over here, we go to our rods. We're using the Nexus Match Rod, the Rutelflug Spinning Reel, 17 pound monofilament, the Bubble Bobber, number seven hook with leeches. Right, so that's it for the uh, Diamond's Peak Challenge missions. If you like the video, hit that like button. If I've earned it, hit that subscribe button. And as always, be safe, be cool, and have fun. We'll catch you in the next one.